Hello guys, I am Cody Cornelius, I am Th Mr. Thor himself, self, the god of thunder. I'm Tanner Galing, the Dark Knight, the Batman. And this is how our story, story of Siege High Avengers was born. It all start, started when I was a kid, kid here, here, that when I was like a little kid, I would always like, you know, be adventurous, like, I was always, um, you know, I was never an out indoor kind of a kid. I was just kind of like an outdoor kind of a kid that I've been more adventurous. And even in school, what high school school for me was kind of okay, okay, and everything. You know, I learned a lot here, but it was just missing that missing element or something. And here and then, like you know, I had my ups and downs in school. I had some good years where I was dressed up as Spider Man man and everything back in my childhood but it just kind of went when I went out of the com comic thing it just like just separated me from it and, and everything and then when I went to California and everything it real something made me realize something that you know when when I was like you know destiny Thor and next thing you know I pick up a hammer at a local toy store and I just had a weird vision in my mind like there were visions after visions like girls being trapped and stuff it was all my dreams was saying something to me I mean that you're destiny Thor Thor and you're gonna be the one to save the world world and everything that's when I got started being Thor and start following but then as years went by and stuff when I first saw the movie the Avengers it blew my mind it just took my mind away like it's just like nothing I never seen before or like it opened my mind to the world and stuff and stuff and then when I went to and when I was with my sister at Pismo Beach and I went into the ocean and I was sitting there there here and next thing you know I saw in the distance like me as Thor and stuff like me doing this and everything here but then it made me realize that you know maybe my guest needs to be Thor Thor here to save the world to stop humanity to end this whole thing thing and stuff and that's what made me believe to be in Thor and I guess I, when I learned from a relative of mine, Jen and of course Batman, they really opened my wor eyes to the world of comics like this is what I'm destined to do. I'm destined to be Thor, Thor here and I'll never, never like give up and I'll fit here. Here I just gotta keep my mighty hammer, hammer which a weird kind of a plant kind of made my hammer hammer in the new movie the Avengers Affinity War or but like I said you know it's just like Dustin and then um when I um got started with this man and we just started like it was finally connecting that we were getting our team together and stuff we have Harley Quinn and and of course Wonder Woman who live in Kentucky Kentucky and everything Greenfield Kentucky here and then like like with Skyfall and stuff it's just like you know, I mean, it's just like Skyfall and Deadpool, you know, I mean, they're trainees and stuff. They're under our watch, but like Batman said, you know, you don't, you don't need, like, what they have. Like, you, need, you don't need two. You don't need three. You can make as many teams as you want, want and stuff for your team. And if we want to do that, then that's fine by us, you know, but our goals are... Are you know it's the same goals that we want to dress up in our costumes and we want to help those in the hospital like brighten up their day, knowing that they met their favorite hero and that's basically what I was being like Thor and stuff. I want kids to look up to me like I'm the mighty Thor, Thor and stuff, stuff and and everything. And that's how my Thor story story is is how I became Thor. Thor, and now I'll let turn it to Mr. Batman. As a kid, I've always been into superheroes. I used to watch Batman, I used to watch Spider-Man, and then that eventually transitioned into my love for comics, and I love reading about them. I've loved them ever since. And um, a few years later, when I found out about cosplay and people dressed up as conventions, I thought, gee, this is fun. And so me and him decided, you know, let's just sort of dress up as our favorite heroes. So I chose Batman because he's always been my favorite hero ever since I was a kid, as long as I could remember. It was Batman. He's my hero. He was my hero then. He's my hero in my childhood, and he will be my hero for the rest of my life. And 
So, um, like he said, we want to help kids and just see, find more nerds like us who are passionate about comics and aren't afraid to show it, aren't ashamed of it, you know, just love comics and just want to get it out there and find more fans and whatnot. Yeah, but like I said, you know, whenever we, fu whenever we, wherever our team, like, you know, when we all finally connect together, together the pieces of the puzzle, puzzle, then for the, fr then, then see just high Avengers will be born, born and stuff, because, because with the team and stuff, like I said, you know, with team and everybody, honey, that's basically our goals, we want to look, have kids look up to us like they are, we're like a hero, yes, hero and stuff, which, by the way, guys, you're doing still a heck of a job, keep up the good work, mm-hmm, yeah, plus, like I said, we look up to you guys, yeah, guys, you, you're like, our heroes, yeah, yeah, it's you kind really of, are. Yeah, and here we are, are and stuff. So all you kids out there, there for the CHS High Avengers, our our thing for you guys: stay in school, school and everything, and believe in something that you love so much. Show it. Mm -hmm. Be it. Yeah. Yeah, and that's how our story begins. Our story begins here. If you guys want to check out more videos, videos and stuff, pay attention to the YouTube. Two page, page to see just high adventures.